equals to that. We're made in his image, but we are not equals, okay? Not even close, okay? He always reveals major events before they happen, and they are recorded in in the Bible by his prophets. So a third purpose of prophecy is that a loving God gives human beings free moral agents, and we also talk about free will, he gave the angels as well free will, because how do we know that? It's because of what happened. And we how do we know what happened? The Bible. Okay. Who must choose between right and wrong, space to repent. It's given time. A, a, a lot of time. Okay. So ancient Israel has been the main recipient of this. Okay. Notice. At 2 Chronicles 7, 14, it says, If my people shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. So in giving the prophet Ezekiel his commission, God stressed what his servants were to do. Okay. And it says, Son of man, I have set you a watchman unto the house of Israel. And it says in brackets, these are the modern nations descendant from ancient Israel. Therefore, you shall hear the word at my mouth and warn them from me. When I say unto the wicked, O wicked man, you shall surely die, if you do not speak to warn the wicked from his way. The wicked man shall die in his iniquity, but his blood will I require at your hand. Nevertheless, if you warn the wicked of his way to turn from it, if he do not turn from his way, he will surely die, but you have delivered your soul. So, warning, okay, before it happens. Giving a chance before it happens. Maybe several chances many 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 chances so when it's done it's done okay we told you we told you a bunch of times you had time you just say you had time but you really didn't told you over and over time 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 and now boop over game over it has been my long and sad experience it goes on to say that most people will not truly listen to what God says. They cannot seem to make themselves take seriously his commands, his instructions, and the numerous, numerous, numerous warnings. With each warning through the ages, okay, some few do heed and they do repent, and those who do not, having been warned, bear responsibility for their choices and for their actions. So now we're at the fourth and last purpose of prophecy. A fourth purpose of prophecy is to motivate those who wish to seek God and claim his promise of protection, knowledge of what is ahead, both the terrible and the wonderful elements. Motis motivates true believers to serve God more fully. Now, the most serious events um, just before God's, um, I'm sorry, Christ's return, okay, will descend like a snare on an unsuspecting world, except for those who watch, pray, and escape. And there's a reference in Luke 21, 36. It says, let's read at verse 35, okay. As a snare shall it come on all of them that dwell on the face of the whole earth. It becomes clear then that a group is promised to be protected during the times that we are approaching, that are just ahead. Now Paul wrote this sobering warning, speaking of warnings guys, of the times and the seasons, brethren, you have no need that I write unto you for you yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so comes as a thief and the night, who when they shall say peace and safety, then suddenly destruction comes upon them, as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall...